Clipping masks are a super fun way to create intros to your videos or even to create promos and just all around look cool when they're actually lined up with things like text or other shapes. That's why in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can create your own clipping mask with your own videos in under 15 minutes, even if you've never edited a video before, all using an online video editor called NVIDIA. So with that being said, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is go to nvidia.io. The link will be in the description for you. Once you are there, you will be greeted with this screen. You just want to go up to the top right to make your completely free account. Type in your username, email, and password, and then you're ready to go. Once you are done, you're going to be greeted with this screen. You want to simply go to the blank canvas over here. This is actually going to take you into the editor, so choose the dimension you're going to be working with. I'm going with a wide 16 by 9 and you want to click make a video. This will take you right into the editor. Once you are in the editor, you're going to be greeted with a completely blank screen. Now to actually start adding your masks, you want to simply look on the left side and you want to scroll down to masks, click it, and you're going to see that you can actually search for masks in the top. For example, there's going to be a bunch of default shapes you can use, but the most common practice is to use letters. So just by looking up like, you know, the letter A, you will see that the clipping mask A pops up. And all you have to do to actually add this to your scene is simply drag and drop it onto the canvas. Now, once it is onto the canvas, you can obviously drag it and even, you know, drag one of the corners and adjust it. But when you want to actually add one of your videos, you can go to upload and you can actually upload your own media here. This is where you can take your video and simply drag and drop it onto the mask. I'm going to go ahead and just use the built in library for the default videos so by clicking here I'm just gonna make sure that I can actually use free stock media so this waterfall looks really cool simply drag and drop it onto the clipping mask hit use full video when it brings up the trim menu and you will see that it clipping masks right into the letter but like you guys can see right here you will see that when I hit play on this that the video is now inside the letter you have successfully created your clipping mask feel free to just search any kind of mask you want for example if I wanted a heart I can search heart and all these different shapes are gonna pop up and all you have to do is remember drag and drop it onto the canvas and then just drag your video on it and it will replace it for you to actually edit the duration of your masks all you have to do is go to this timeline button right here you will see that this is clipping mask 2 and this is clipping mask 1 and they do pop up both when I actually hit play but when clipping mask 2 runs out it does not loop and it just goes away so to fix that all you have to do is drag it out and it will just continually loop the video so you can keep that scene as long as you want it but once you are satisfied with your video you want to go up to the top right hit download and share it's gonna bring up this export menu you want to click export and this is where you're going to be able to download your video it'll say getting your videos and then the download button is going to be right here after it is completely done rendering if you did enjoy this video do give us a like and also check out this video where I show you guys how you can add amazing overlays things like smoke powder effect and light leaks and so much more this has been Brady with NVIDIA and I'll catch you guys in the next one